So here I go, starting my dive off. Uh, I'm gonna be diving in about 25 feet of water. Uh, it's the top of sort of an underwater pinnacle that I found, and I know there's bass around. I've been seeing them all day. The previous dive with my camera, I had, saw to see, I had seen a school of about 40 of them or so. So I wanna get to the bottom, get myself into some cover. So you see there, I crawl over that ledge there, and now I'm just gonna wait, see what shows up. So slowly looking around, not moving around too much, and sure enough, a bass is going to present itself. Definitely saw me come down and, and wanted to check me out. So gives me a perfect broadside shot. All right, let's see that again. So the fish is moving in slow, just checking me out. And I bring up my gun nice and slow so I don't, so I don't spook it. That's the first thing I do. And then if you notice, I aim right at the, at the center still. So, and I actually miss a little bit low, but that's why I always say to, to aim for the gill plate, because even if you miss by a little bit, you're still going to get a great holding shot, and that's what you see happened here. So instead of a perfect broadside, I was actually shooting from below, uh, so the, the spear ended up exiting through, through the brain, um, and was e easily able to land this fish. So at this point, the only thing left to do is to get control of the fish, which is, it's, it's not, a big, not a big giant striper, so it's not a big deal, and then uh, hand it off to my buddy on the boat.